been singing six years this month I became a singer. And before that, prior to this, I was uh, I was accompanying dancers and writing music for dance companies and sort of going in, in and out of different musical oh, avenues of expression. Yeah. No, I never danced myself, but I learned a lot from dancers. I learned that the body, the whole body, is is my instrument and I should be able to use all of it, be conscious of it. Um, so you're right, yeah, this this is a pretty new thing for me. Yeah. What's your age right now? My, my age? Your age? 33. Well, that's late, but I mean, you start to go your music. Yeah, some people know at a very young age, but when I was always never searching. Was, you never considered singing? No, not until then. I sang um, in the church choir. I was brought up Episcopalian, and so I, you know, I, I was exposed to some very good, uh, not necessarily gospel music. We didn't sing gospel music in church. It was it was more the, uh, the some of the sacred music of uh, you know Handel and Bach and, and Mozart and those people. But I never considered singing seriously until I was 27. But you told me about your father, man. Uh, old notes for two minutes and things. Yeah, he's, was he, he an influence or? He was in an indirect way. Um, he's an opera singer. He sang with the Metropolitan Opera. He made his debut, debut when I was about six. We were living in New York City, and my mother, he and my mother met in the church choir, in their church choir. Uh, so I was influenced by them just because I was around when I was a kid. So I absorbed a lot of things when I was growing up. Destiny, now, right? Destiny could be. Both my parents are singers, my sister's a singer. And I kind of just stayed away from it for a long time, I don't know why.